Hello, I'm Brian Tracy, and I want to talk to you now about leadership qualities. More than 50 qualities have been identified that are important to great leaders. But there are seven leadership qualities that seem to stand out as being more important than the others. The good news is that each of these leadership qualities can be learned, and they must be learned by practice and repetition. First of all, great leaders have vision. They can see into the future. They, they have a clear, exciting idea of where they are going and what they're trying to accomplish, and they're excellent at strategic planning in getting there. Now, this quality of vision separates them from managers. Having a clear vision turns the individual into a special type of person. This quality of vision changes that transactional manager, someone who works with people to get the job done, into a transformational leader, someone who transforms the future of the business. While a manager gets the job done, great leaders tap into the emotions of their employees. Now, the second quality of a great leader is courage. The quality of courage means that you are willing to take risks in the achievement of your goals with no assurance of success. Because there's no certainty in life or business, every commitment you make and every action you take entails a risk of some kind. Among the seven leadership qualities, courage is the most outwardly identifiable trait of a leader. The third quality is integrity. In every strategic planning session that I've conducted for large and small corporations, the first value that all the gathered executives agree upon for their company is integrity. They all agree on the importance of complete honesty in everything they do, both internally and externally. The core of integrity is truthfulness. Integrity requires that you always tell the truth to all people in every situation. Truthfulness is the foundation quality of the trust that is necessary for the success of any business. The fourth quality of a great leader is humility. Great leaders are those who are strong and decisive, but also humble. Humility doesn't mean that you're weak or unsure of yourself. It means that you have the self-confidence and self-awareness to recognize the value of others without feeling threatened. It means that you are willing to admit that you could be wrong, that you recognize you may not have all the answers. And it means that you give credit where credit is due. The fifth quality is strategic planning. Great leaders are also outstanding at strategic planning. They have the ability to look ahead, to anticipate with some accuracy where the industry and the markets are going. Leaders have the ability to anticipate trends well in advance of their competitors. They continually ask, based on what is happening today, where is the market going? Where is it likely to be in three months, six months, one year, and two years? What will customers want? And they do this through thoughtful strategic planning. Leaders always focus on the needs of the company and the situation. Leaders focus on results, on what must be achieved by themselves and by others and by the company. Great leaders focus on strengths in themselves and in others. They focus on the strengths of the organization, on the things that the company does best in satisfying demanding customers in a competitive marketplace. Your ability as a leader to call the shots and make sure that everyone is focused and concentrated on the most valuable use of their time is essential to the excellent performance of your company. The most important contribution you can make to your company is to be a leader, to accept responsibility for results, and to dare to go forward. Now, thank you for watching this video on leadership qualities. If you enjoyed this video, please press the like button below and click on the link on the screen to subscribe to my YouTube channel.